Good afternoon, everybody. As you can see, I have my precious little Nicole, which most of you should know that this is Tink, sculpted by Bonnie Brown. And I gotta say, guys, oh my goodness, as you guys know, it, well, if you have followed my channel, most of you know that um, I shied away from preemies. Just uh, you guys basically know my reasonings, uh, mostly because of finding clothes for them. But since I have been able to, oh my goodness, there's a fly in here that's gonna drive me crazy. Did you see it? I saw it. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Anyways, um, here recently I have been able to find clothing, so it hasn't been a big deal. But I gotta tell you, you know, even if I didn't have clothing and she just was in a onesie all the time and covers, I would not even care. This baby is so precious. And I gotta say, the artist, wow, has captured this sculpt amazingly. I just, this baby is done to perfection. That's all I can say, perfection. <laughs> Anyhow, as you guys know, um, last week's theme Thursday was unicorns. I did do one video with uh, my tiger Lily, which is my, who I'm calling Ariana. I did put her in a theme Thursday dress. Of course, it did not get uploaded till Friday. And you guys know I'm always late. But I do have so many unicorn outfits. And I have been wanting to put this precious little outfit on that I purchased for Nicole. So I figured, uh, who cares how late I am? I'm just going to make it unicorn week. <laughs> so I hope you enjoy Without any more rambling, um, I want to get started. As you can see, I have some unicorns kind of just all around her. I have her little personal one, excuse my arm, her little tiny unicorn that she will be holding. Also, I did just go to Michael's, and I'll show you why later, because I have a haul I want to share with you, and it's kind of like an everything haul, but it is somewhat reborn related one way or another. But I just picked up this little guy, so he will be in my haul video next. But I figured, you know, why not put him in this video? So I'm going to try to get a little closer to Nicole. And forgive me, even though we're right in front of the window, it's because of how you set up. And it's so weird. If you wasn't, because I'm right in front of the window, you don't get the best lighting. And I know that doesn't seem right, but um, since the light is casting you know, from behind her, it's not going to show her eyes versus if the window was behind me, it would be showing her gorgeous blue eyes. But we are going to make do. She is so tiny that I don't like to put her on the table because then there's quite a bit of distance from her to the camera and then you really can't see her. But I want to see if I can go up a little bit, if that helps any. <clears throat> it may or may not. I don't know. I'm trying to, and that fly is really going to get on my nerves, I can already tell you. I cannot believe it's in here. I did not see it earlier, but okay, I'm just trying to get adjusted, and that fly is right beside me, of course. Look, I just saw it go through the screen. Oh my goodness, this is going to drive me crazy. Anyways, so um, I know you guys saw this in one of my hauls, but I have to show it to you again really quickly. Look at the pants of this. This is the, the bum bum, and... The way this Carter's outfit is made, it's almost like it's puffy for the butt, which I thought was super cute. And here's the front. So there's a floral design. It's a white background, and it has pink, yellow, and blue, and uh, darker pink, and then even gray leaves, flowers all over it. And then it comes with two onesies, one of which is long sleeves, which I'm not going to put on her because it has been in the 90s here. Even though it, the last couple of days we have got rain, thank goodness. Um... And it's so cute, though. It says, every day is magical with mommy. I just want to show you it, even though I'm not going to put it on her. Um, but this onesie that went with it is the short sleeve version. And it has the unicorn on it. And it says, small and unique. How adorable. And how fitting. So, that is what's going to go on her. And then I did find a yellow and gold pacifier that fits her. And I did have to tie this but a little yellow headband and some roughly socks. Now, I know that this is part of the haul that I have not yet got to, but saying since I'm going to be putting them on her for this, hold on, let me see. Let me make sure I've got the right ones, though. Um, yes, okay. 
So these little guys I got at Michael's, which is some of the haul that I'm going to share with you guys next. And I've already tried them on her. That's why they look kind of funny in here. So they fit her. And in the, if you guys can see, um, the unicorn's horn is silver. And also in the onesie. So I figured these little high top gym shoes or converse looking shoes with uh, gray or silver sparkles would look so sweet. Um, I did get other ones. This little girl is going to be so spoiled, let me tell you. But she had to have shoes. And as you guys know, the newborn shoes are actually big on our newborn baby. So there's no way that I would ever find her um, shoes to fit. <laughs> So we have to go with dolly shoes, but it works, and I don't care because they're super cute. So we are going to put those on her. But um, I do have some roughly socks to go underneath them so that there's no dye transfer. Hopefully not. But how could you not like these little shoes? Let me see. I think they go that way. Yes. How adorable. Oh, my goodness. Okay, so, so there she is is her complete outfit so that's everything so now all I got to do is get her ready hopefully I can do this without getting in the way of the camera guys I'm gonna try this and I love this little outfit as you guys know it came with a little hat which I ended up taking off just so you know it wasn't pulling at her hair but I think you know her generally her hair is in pretty good so I don't think I have much to worry about but you know I want to preserve her as best as possible, but I got to tell you, her varnish, oh, I don't think I'm going to have any problems with, with her paint staying. Oh, she's beautiful. She's very well textured, and I could tell that there is a good amount of varnish or um, whatever it is that she uses on her, so she's going to have quite a bit of protection, which... I absolutely love that. <clears throat> okay. Oh, there she is. So I got her propped up pretty good. <laughs> so it might be a little difficult changing her. But if I could really quick, I don't know if I showed this before, but just laying there, do you see her beautiful veins? Oh my goodness. Let me see if I can get close. Because this baby is quite amazing when it comes to her little details. Let's see. See, you know, you cannot see half as what I'm seeing in person, but she is quite amazing. Oh my goodness, and those little feet. I don't know if you could see her texture, maybe a little there. I mean, this baby is awesome. Let me see. Do you see the veins there? Oh, she's so amazing. And her little nails are to die for. Oh, her little neck. Oh, sorry, Mama. Look at those. And her eyes are just the most realistic. And they almost look like she's tearing up. And of course, we're in such a bad um, angle of the lighting. So I'm not going to be able to show you her true um, look of her eyes. But she is quite amazing. You can take my word for it. <laughs> Alright, you know what? I'm going to have to... Let me see if I can move... The way I'm set up here, I'm going to move her little pillow for a moment so I may lay her down. Okay, this way it's a little bit easier as far as to dress her. Oh, I love this baby. And I mean, look at this vein. Oh my goodness, I wish you could see her eyes. Let me see if this. See, the way, you know, it's so funny when you're right in front of the, the uh, window, you would think you would get a lot of light but yeah that is not the case at all but she's precious anyways okay enough rambling let me get her dressed all right oh i still have the tangs let me get the tags off sorry about that all right guys let me get her little onesie over her little hair without messing it up too bad okay Oh, sorry, Mama. Sounds like they're all leaving to go to the store. So sorry about the background noise. 
It sounds like Tommy's begging for chips. <laughs> Goodness, guys. You know how that is. Oh. And it's so, even though I put pretty good weight to her, it's so funny. I could just lift her with one arm. She's so little. You know, I did realize that she was a preemie. And I knew she was going to be small. But she, her little, oh, there went the unicorn. Her little features are very, very small. I mean, um, even her body, as you guys know, was super short. I felt like a little too short for her, her limbs. Um, if you're just joining me, I did change her body to the Ashley preemie body from Bountiful Baby. I just felt like she would fit clothing better. Because as you see, even with that body, um, Carter's preemie is still a little baggy. So she is just a little fart. Yes, yeah, she is. Look at her. Okay, so the pants. <clears throat> and I love how she naturally crosses her little legs there. <laughs> But I gotta tell you, I, I am just, I am so amazed with this artist's work, and I definitely want to get more babies from this artist in the future. I actually have a kit, which isn't going to be anytime soon, but sometime in the future, I would love her to reborn this kit for me, but I'm going to keep that a secret, guys. But uh, yeah, I really do love this artist's work, and uh, I'm very excited about um eventually owning more work from her oh goodness look at her oh i probably should have put the socks on first but let's do that now so these are just really tiny um dress roughly socks it's basically the only socks i have i know that's gonna look silly for a minute that fit the little ones so i just want to do this just so i can get the boots on first <clears throat> So I hope everybody's doing well in the community. I did see a few people that got um, a new baby to their family or to their collection. So congratulations to all of you. I don't want to start naming just in case I leave out. Let me make sure. See, I don't know if there's a left or a right to these guys. What do you think? Maybe there is. Hmm. I can't. Hold on, because I thought it was the other way. How bad is this, guys? <laughs> Anyways, all right. Now, I will say, these shoes are just as much as, you know, buying... You know what? That looks like, like the wrong foot. These shoes are just as much as buying um, a pair of Carter shoes from Walmart. But yet, they are ve very delicate. I will say that. They are cute. They will serve a purpose for her, you know, for the videos. But the quality is very thin, I will say that. Um, I don't know. See her little toe. The only thing is, is her little toe sticks up on this side. So it's going to have a little bit of a lump coming out on the side. Here, Mama, lift your foot up. But again, for pictures and just for changing videos, I think it's not really going to matter. But again, yeah, these would definitely not be shoes for a real baby. <laughs> they I, I, they definitely would not withstand wear and tear, if that makes any sense to you guys. But I just know they're going to be super adorable for what I'm going to use them for. Yes, they are. Even though the glittery socks. See what I mean by the lump right there? That's her little toe. <laughs> She's cut sticking up there. So I'm going to try to put... Let me see if I can do this. I wanted to put her pants over top of the... Oh, there we go. It worked. Up top of the socks. So all you saw was the ruffle and the shoes. Oh my God, guys. Tell me that that isn't just the cutest thing ever. <laughs> oh, come on. You guys got to love it. You got to love it. All right, so I don't make you sit through this. I'm going to throw the other one on her, and I'll be right back. Okay, guys. So let me brush her little hair a little bit. I did wet the brush just a, a little bit. Look at them shoes. Oh, I'm just in love with those little shoes. So adorable. Okay. I think it goes this way, yes. 
So I did have to tie this, like I said, for her little head. It's a little head. But she has so much hair, though. It's like, let me see how I'm going to do that. Let's get it combed out of it, I guess. There. <laughs> oh, my goodness. I mean, how can you not love this? And she spit her pacifier up. But there she is. Oh, goodness. I don't know if I want to try to make it stick up here. I'm not tried that with her yet. Like, make her look like she has a little bit of a... Sticking up at the top. Oh, my goodness. Alright, guys. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to try to shut this and see if the light makes any difference. Because I just don't like what I'm getting here. Which I understand is never good. Okay, let me see if that made any difference at all. Um, bear with me. <clears throat> Moving some lights around. Okay, I used to have so much light in here. I just don't understand. Okay. Well, that didn't work much. This lamp wants to be difficult. Okay. <laughs> I don't think it did much as far as light. Um, I don't think it made it worse or better. But there she is. She has her beautiful uni unicorn outfit on. And she's looking so cute with her new little gym shoes. Let me show you up close. These adorable <laughs> little shoes. Oh my goodness. And you got to see her little bum bum. Her little bum bum. She's like, what are you doing to me, mama? But oh my goodness, if I can take some pictures and put them on Instagram, I will. Because she is just super sweet. All little 17 inches of her. Oh my goodness. So I hope you enjoyed this little changing video. Um, as much as I did, we got to give her her little unicorn. So, I, I, you know, I'm thinking about taking the tags off of these things. I know they say not to, but, you know, it doesn't serve much purpose for the reborns if you don't. So, but all right. So she has her little unicorn and her new little sneakers. So she's saying bye everyone. All right. So I will be back as soon as I can with a changing video, but... Until then, I hope you enjoyed, and I'm sorry about the lighting. I thought um, I would have had a better lighting than what I do, but you know how it is. She still looks precious, even though it's super dark, but thanks for joining me anyhow, and I hope to see you in my next video. Have a wonderful evening.